Hello and welcome to the last part of Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories. Re Chain of Memories with me, TK, and Snowman17. And we're playing a little drinking game with Riku's side of the story. Yeah, that's what we're going to do today because his story is the last one. But pretty much all of his story is is just him getting rid of the darkness. And these are the trials that he goes through through Castle Oblivion. So yeah, it, it's called Reverse Rebirth. But since he's getting rid of the darkness, they mention it like more than 50 times a night. So in that case, we're going to make it into a little drinking game. You came drifting here by yourself. Shut up. You did not have the strength. <sighs> so yeah. You know, in our last playthrough of this... Ooh, you like the <laughs> <And our laughs> Snowman over here is playing, what's this game called? Minecraft. And he's just being a dick, but since I feel You're like... You're right, I'm being a dick. I'm punching a duck. Since since Punch. since I don't feel like recording Punch. this any more than Punch. he does, I'm just trying to blow through this. Punch. Anyway. This duck is going to die. Oh, it's the light. Now we got to throw up. <laughs> anyway, he has to go through the same trials as Sora and use the same cards as him pretty much. It's a card to kill ducks. Oh, does it? That's no. Oh, shut up. Anyway, there's no Donald, Sora, or Goofy in this one, so we can't make fun of their voices in this. Spaghettios. Matter of fact, I had some Spaghettios yesterday. That's delicious. Yes, it is. Let there be light. Let there be deliciousness. Just take the card, Riku, and then call him Daddy. I'm gonna bite, I promise. I just won't bite hard. <laughs> seemed like a boring place to take a nap anyway. In your that mom's house. Very well said, Riku. Oh god, it was a grenade! <laughs> <laughs> Pikachu, bolt tackle. <laughs> oh man. We don't even have our mic sets. We're just recording this from my laptop. Yeah. <laughs> laptop to laptop interface. If you do that, will that like create like super awesome static or something? I don't know. If it is, then we're recording Static. Static Shock! That was a great show. That and Batman Beyond. Matter of fact, didn't they team up in one episode? Yeah. Was there was the, actually, it was an episode of Justice League where they go to the future. Oh! Static Shock's an old man. Yup, oh, darkness. Take a drink. God damn it. Come on, I know you heard me. Every word uh. I said to Madison. Maleficent. By the way, in between the levels on this game... Yeah, you pretty much go through his side of the story, but since I was lazy, I just said, let's just do the cutscenes. But basically, he goes through the whole level again, just like Sora. You have no choice. <gasps> Look at him, T Snowman, in his magnificent tan. Oh my god, he's a black Disney character. <laughs> he's more of a Square Enix character. We haven't seen one of those since Sing Along Sally. <laughs> <laughs> want to pull me back in oh. so you can play puppet master dang it clever boy he's, a, he's probably I even voiced by one one James Earl Jones he, I think he's voiced by the guy who played the, some guy in Lord of the Rings I forgot it was the guy who said you shall not pass Gandalf? yeah Gandalf but no Did you really I just died Thanks. I buried myself in the <laughs> My song radar is going off the chain. Oh my gosh, I didn't die. That's amazing. <sighs> but anyway, obviously Riku can't beat Ansem because he's too weak and he sucks. Ah! I'm drowning! Yeah, and Snowman's getting his ass kicked on Minecraft. I am not ass kicking of the ass. You know what this relationship reminds me of, Snowman? Who? Sasuke and Uchimaru. Orochimaru. Orochimaru? Yeah! Ansem is his Orochimaru, and he's training him to be evil. But then you got Mickey to come down. Hey, look, it's a fairy! <laughs> Your Majesty? That's right! Remember, oh he turned into Navi. Oh. He turned into a Navi. A fairy, if you will. And he went. Holy and oops. How did I manage that? Listen it's close. suspended in the air. Yeah, I like it how, like, Mickey role in this game is just to act as, like, a guide to Riku, but he doesn't actually join him. Yeah, spoilers, whatever. It's pretty obvious. They always say Mickey till the end. Yeah. 
Because he's the king. So that Epic Mickey, like then he was the king. I heard Epic Mickey sucked. From the darkness that I, I hope not. Oh, darkness. darkness. Take a drink. Mm. Well, no boss. That all you got? It mm. seems to me that you We don't need a boss. I'm not going to do the darkness. boss battles unless the organization. All right. The organization is the only people I really care about. Not Ansem. He can, he can go suck a dick. Am I underwater or something? This is a card. I don't get it. What's so good about Minecraft? The world it, we don't it looks stupid. It looks like you're killing yourself. Uh, well, I am, but you're not supposed to. <sighs> will not give you distance from the darkness. Distance. Oh, no darkness. Darkness. Take a drink. Again? Don't worry, I'm not running. Mm. Give it. I'll enter the world, and in the end, mm. if I haven't given in to the darkness. Yep. Darkness. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just waiting on it. Mm. Ugh. I have one more gift. That'd be funny if he threw the card and just slashed his face. Oh god. Oh my heart! Oh my cholesterol! <laughs> I sprained my ankle. <laughs> I need some cereals! <laughs> we need some rice krispies. <laughs> Still that crack pop. pop. That's who we are. That crack pop. It's the sounds of star. I'll be waiting. Recoup. He'll be waiting for us at the top of the castle. In darkness. And yield to the darkness. No, take a break. Oh, no. <laughs> you knew it was coming. You knew it was coming. Mm. Viewers, play along too. Get your favorite drink and just have it on standby. Anyway, here's the introduction to the organization, organization Riku fights. An emo and a big guy. That Zexian in the emo haircut, and that's Lex Larkson? Le Lexius? Something like that. No, it's Lexius in, uh, what's it called? And there's Vexen, when he was still alive before he was killed by Axel, with a snap. <laughs> that was awesome. Unfair disbelief. <laughs> Anyway, just like uh, just like Marluxia and them, they want to take over the organ. Well, they don't want to take over. They want to get rid of Marluxia and them, but they want to use Riku. So I guess you could pretty much say their plans are the same. But they got Sora and they got Riku. We got them all. Kind of like how Pokemon. Pokemon sucks. I heard. I seek the new. That's what I should have did. I played black. Yeah, I should have played like Heart Gold and Soul Silver while we were recording this in, in light of the new Pokemon game coming out. Yeah, I heard that their new designs for the Pokemon are terrible. Yeah, they're lacking. They suck. I'm sorry. Creativity. I don't blame them though. It's been going on for a long time. But they should just start doing inanimate objects and putting faces on them. They do. Yeah. Anyway, Zexion is one of my favorite characters because, well, he just looks like a real organization member. He looks like a badass. He does. Look at him. He got uh, e Look, it's like a little emo haircut. Don't you like that? I'm not into guys. Shut up. Um, what was I about to say? He makes an appearance in Birth by Sleep. Actually, all three of these guys do, but in their original forms. I think his name was Evan, his name was Ienzo, and I don't remember Larxia's name. He, he's not important. He's the big stoic big guy that doesn't say anything except one word. See what develops. See? <laughs> we see what develop. We wait. <laughs> no. <laughs> we wait. Stop. <laughs> Something smells Go ahead. Good. Wait. <laughs> Whoa, wait. What's that what was that from? It's so familiar. It smells like darkness. Darkness. <laughs> <laughs> Take a drink. I can't believe this is happening. Oh. Darkness has seeped into my skin. Yep, take a drink. Jesus. Darkness seeped into his skin. Oh, take a drink. Here comes Navi. <laughs> Don't seep into the darkness. Turn into Mickey. He should just be with them. Oh, it is Mickey. Why is he dressed up like... I told you, it's designed by Namora. He has belts and, wi 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 belts and zippers all over him. You see right through me. How do you do that shit? Request? Listen, Riku. I want you to go pick up this pizza I ordered for you two years ago. 
It should be waiting You've by now. You've got to fight the darkness inside you. Ah, darkness. Take yeah. a drink. <laughs> I was into but something. Don't forget. Even in the darkest darkness. Oh, take a drink. <laughs> I told you. This is the greatest drinking game ever. This is better than never have I ever. I have seen it. The far welcoming light inside mm. the door to darkness. The darkness. <laughs> Again, take a drink. I don't even got time to make you know what? That's it. I'm getting the two liter and I'm bringing it over here. I got it right here. <laughs> oh god. Best. Come on, say it. Anyway, he's all like, oh, Riku, go, and who gives a shit? The point is, Mickey wants to help Riku, but he's not there, but he's there in spirit, literally. Literally. Kind of like, who was it, Anakin? Not Anakin. Uh, something Skywalker? Not Skywalker. Who was the guy in fucking Star Wars that was like, Luke, use the Force? Obi-Wan Kenobi? Yeah, that guy. Fuck you. Fuck pop culture. <laughs> I'm a Star Trek fan. Uh -huh. I'm a Trekkie. Where's my Spock ears? Where's my Spock ears? It'd be funny if I just pulled some out. Anyway, they're just brooding and waiting. This is what all these guys do. They're in the basement of, of uh, Castle Oblivion, by the way. That's why it's so dark down here. Riku, you say. Has he emerged from the darkness? Take a drink. Damn it. <laughs> His existence... It was once doubled in the darkness. Duh, take a drink. Ah. That's why you mistook him for the superior. The anyway, Riku used to be the Keyblade Master, Snowman. Did he? Yeah. And then he lost it because he was such a jerk because he fell into darkness. You know what you're going to do? You're taking away your Keyblade. That's really. That's exactly what happened. They're all like, they're, I'm going to give it to Sora because he's friends with Goofy and Donald. Sora is in the castle. Oh damn. He arrived early. He's in the dark. Oh, I know. already using Namine's unique powers to meddle with Sora's heart. And then they're talking about, with yeah, spoilers. Namine is really a nobody. Whatever. Is spoilers it since we're at the end? Yeah, it, 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 we did all of, of, of Sora, so. You guys are just getting some extra bit with us just talking because we're really not into this plot. We're just using this for to kill time and to finish it off. Is we the hero of darkness? Oh, take a drink. <laughs> He's the hero of darkness. Does that even make sense? Uh, and here's a bad edit by TK. Just because he <laughs> he used KH uh, dot com's uh, cutscenes to make this. Are you with Ansem? Uh, no. You are half correct. Oh, and by the way, that actually has a meaning to something. Uh, Vexen, he used he technically worked for uh. uh Answer. Perhaps a nobody best conveys. <laughs> Get it? He's a nobody. That's Try what they're again. called. Oh. Shit! <laughs> he just said dark. <laughs> this game would be so Catching much better without Paul. It would be. We'd just be wasted just talking. <laughs> oh, look, he's blonde. He looks like a chick. I would totally do her. <laughs> You know that makes you gay, right? <laughs> Shut up! I'm drunk! There really is I'm darkness. Oh, okay. darkness! Take a drink! Damn it. <laughs> the sword is. Oh, another darkness! And so are you for reeking of that awful smell! Oh, so it's a fight! You. Smell like dick! Very good! I shall take you off! Great eyed man! And. Oh, I love it. Anyway, here's our first boss fight. <laughs> Didn't Ice we? Shield. <laughs> Ice shield. Nice shield. <laughs> anyway, the cutscenes are still in Japanese, or the fight scenes are. I'm gonna smash you out with my ice sickles. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hungry. Aren't you hungry? Nope, I ate pizza. Oh yeah, that's right. We had pizza earlier, like always, whenever we do these videos. But they ran out of pepperoni. You're out of fucking pizza? How the fuck do you run out of pepperoni? I remember I went to Taco Bell this one time, and they were out of tacos! I was out of soft shells. You know what no, they were out of hard shells. Okay, whatever. Soft shells, who gives a shit? They were out of fucking hard fucking shells. What's the fucking point if you can't eat tacos? Anyway, in this mode, I mean, in Riku's game, you can actually go in his, like, super mode. 
The only drawback is he's wearing a skirt. <laughs> oh, look, look, he's wearing a freaking skirt. Yeah, I can see it. Thank you. I am here, you know. I mean, like, you're not, but you gotta, like, literally embrace this. Look, he's getting, he's beating up a blonde hair guy with a skirt. So you got something against blondes and skirts? Eh, there's nothing wrong with it, as long as it's not Devin. <laughs> Storm yeah. room. <laughs> oh, that's disgusting. Anyway, Riku can summon uh Mickey and he can do do random shit. I don't know. I never made it a freaking Riku story. Because I suck at this game, like seriously. Alright, another cutscene, Snowman. He finally uses his damn. I'm waiting for that one scene where it says darkness, 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 darkness. <laughs> There is a darkness ah, didn't take a drink. <laughs> well worth the trouble of aggravating you. Mm. All this, this, this is gonna be fun. He's finally using his shield as a shield. What? Bat wing. Thanks, I really like his sword though. It looks cool. Sumi. I like pie. Hey, look, it's sexy. I mean, sexy. What's happening to Sora? Anyway, in between this game, since Sora is upstairs and Riku is in the basement, um, they just pretty much are like conversating about like what they're doing, what Marluxia and them are doing upstairs, and what they're planning on doing Riku downstairs. Anyway, Zexion is like the mastermind, Larxius is the brute, and Vexen is just the bitch. <laughs> <laughs> There's no sugarcoating it, folks. He's a bitch. No, seriously, he is. He really doesn't do that much. It's really just these two. A lot of fangirls ship them together. A lot of fangirls do that, anyway. I don't do that. You shut up. You and your fan fiction. I don't have fan fiction. Have you ever read a bad fan fiction? I've read... never read fan fiction, period. I think you have. It's a dog! Surprise? I guess you should be. Oh, wait. It's it's his clone. After all, I look just like you. No shit. <laughs> so they had to show it? Yeah. <laughs> After <laughs> all, I look like you. And the creator was just like, wait, what? And they zoomed out. Oh. <laughs> so you're a fake me. So wait, what if he was just looking in the mirror the whole time? I don't then care he was talking. if you're real. I don't know. That just creeped you're the fuck better. out of me. You ever look in the mirror and you just thought yourself you did something else? You're like, holy balance. shit! Nope. I did. Well, I'm smart, so... There is one easy way to tell us apart, though. I like darkness. Come on. Say it. You know you want to. Come on. Come on. I was Unlike you, I the... fear nothing. Damn. Shit! You calling me a coward? You know you're chicken! Look, look! Darkness inside. Yep, oh, take a drink. Yeah, you're already taking a drink. Because you knew it was coming. Yeah. What darkness? That I, darkness. What darkness? <laughs> this darkness. <laughs> that darkness. I can do whatever I want. Like even wear a skirt. Even though his outfit is pretty cool. He has a muscle suit. This is what Vanitas like wears. In crisis. Vanitas wears that in Birth by Sleep. If you guys haven't uh, played Birth by Sleep, I advise you guys to go. I'm going to try to hold back on spoilers of that. That encoded, because they are both out by the time I'm recording. I think it's time to some shit on fire. And Snowman is still obsessed with this stupid-ass game called uh, Blocks. Who's that? <sighs> and we both have Android phones. I got me a 4G phone, Epic. Ah, burn, motherfucker! And he's burning down trees. Hey, that tree deserves it. <sighs> What's in there, man? <laughs> tree burner. Soda! Skirt lover. There's nothing wrong with loving skirts. You know, back in like the 90s, they used to call them skirt chasers. Why don't you chase women? There's nothing wrong with chasing women. Even girls chase other girls. Yep, they should be. Ah, oh, crap, I burned down the whole forest. Oh, nice! What's Smokey the Bear gonna say? Hey, <laughs> stop it. <laughs> only you can put out forest fires. But only you started it. <laughs> <laughs> uh. look at the forest. God damn it, I can only be so many places at once. And so we beat the Wreck Look. Burn everything! That tickled. 
Zoom, zoom. I'm still going to burn this whole place down. I don't care anymore. And so hey, we beat Rico, hey. as I said. I thought I heard hey, you say jerk. You were going to wipe the floor with me. I'm going to make some pie. Yeah, this, look at all these don't green. See all that green? That's all going to be on fire. He's I'm literally strong, burning down the strong. forest. I'm, I'm sorry. Burning. I'm sorry. It's just more interesting You're than finished. this. Watch out, Edison Bolt. Anyway, get him, Riku. I blocked it with my darkness. <laughs> darkness. <laughs> that was the corniest <laughs> laugh ever. For a second, I thought he was going to go, ha <laughs> fuck. <laughs> you are so missing out. You're missing out I on this awesome surgery I have. Be so thrilling. The darkness. Enough. I won't go back in the darkness. So now the coward is playing tough. So long, real thing. Anyway, I'm stuck doing filler while somebody's doing something more important right now. Anyway, he Come runs back. away like a pansy. Hey, wait. Come back. Tell me more about this darkness. <laughs> We're so used to this troop. We're just like abusing it now. No way. Come I'm on. I'm not a coward. I won't run away from the darkness. I'm not chicken. What was that? I'm going to engulf the entire world in fire. You and fire. Purification! So, how was the real thing? Burn the non-believers! Flames of Rekka. No time at all. I'll be better than him. Anyway, this Riku wants to be better than the real Riku, so he can be the real Riku. You want to know why, Snowman? Why? Because there only can be one! Highlander! Turning trees. The there can only be one tree left standing. Want me to take care of him? Not even that. Let's see. But anyway, since... I love how they updated this. Updated what? Fucking... Now, now the trees have different types of bark on it. Fuck Minecraft. Whoever plays that, kill yourself. Yeah, that's right. I'm pointing at you. Whoever's watching this. You can't see my finger, but I'm pointing. <laughs> but... <laughs> I gotta give a quick shout out to my magic, because... They're awesome. What? I like watching their videos. It makes me happy. It makes me fat. They get some really good shit going on. Good shit. Anyway, here's Ansem, or Orochimaru, if you will. What are you saying? Isn't are he you just a father? copy of me? No, I'm the More darkness. More like a model. And you actually are right. He is the darkness. <laughs> he accepts the darkness. Oh, take a drink. Damn it. <laughs> just like you once couldn't help but accept uh, me. Anyway, just to catch some now, stuff up, um, Snowman, Riku went into darkness because he was jealous of Sora, and he wanted more power, so. When have I been and now, in the dark? oh, shit. <laughs> anyway, he wanted to be better than Sora, so he gave himself to darkness so he can be stronger, but obviously it overtook him, and everything sucks now. And so, it's like taking drugs. Now he sucks. No, I can't live without it. Yeah. And they're just trying to get him addicted again. See, so why does everybody keep doing that? <laughs> I know. This game has some unfortunate implications to drugs. Here's a card. Go meet this guy at the gas station in 12 minutes. <laughs> Stick it in your arm and find out. I could like duck something. What is with you lighting everything on fire? Why don't you light the water on fire? I can. Uh, you can. It's not very obvious. Uh -huh. <laughs> anyway, we're back up at the Legion of Doom. Remember these guys? Sora. I really don't like how he lifts his eyebrows after everything he says. Yeah, see? It's Axel, a Roy Mustang, and Lisa Hawkeye. Here we go again. It's Holy crap, something fell. So you can carry out your little experiments. Anyway, he's just trying to get these guys in on their plan, and he's trying to get on in on their plan. So which side will win? The ones are in the basement, or the ones will... Who, the nobodies that are in the basement, or the nobodies upstairs? Who will win? The losers in the basement not doing anything, or the guy who's actually outside talking to people? <laughs> that too. You decide. The one with the, the group with the hot chick in it, or the group in the basement with all men. You're gonna need this. Darn, I can't light it up on fire. I want duck a la raj. Duckling a la raj? <laughs> You're not even pronouncing that right. Duck a la raj. We actually made that joke already. <laughs> I, was, I was watching a video. It was like in the second video. Anyway, here's Riku. Where? What? It's just a Riku. Right there. Talk. 
<laughs> anyway, they want to rewrite Riku's memory, so it could seem like he's he's in love with Nomine, pretty much. What? A card? What good is that? This is in Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> we play children's card games where I come from. You want to remake my heart? No, we just want to make you fall in love. It's the second worst thing. <laughs> No, no. That sucks. That's, that's, that's terrible. I know. There's no tragedy. Shut up. Anyway. How can you? Are you betraying me? No. I'm betraying I told everybody. You I would make good use of you. You're part of an evil organization, homie. Everybody's going to betray you, homie. Throw me. It's like the star scream of uh, the Megatron. Not Megatron. Shut up! <laughs> If you gave me simpler tasks, I wouldn't fail so much. All me. these, all the Rikus on this game are just getting their asses handed to. They can't even land one attack. Everybody has this invisible shield that oh. nobody explains to Riku how they do it. I <laughs> know. He just tries to attack. Oh, shut up! Ting. Hey, cool. Oh, yeah, I remember Cherry Boy. Tink. Damn it! Yeah. Nominee's just in the corner watching this. But anyway. Uh, he's finna get raped. Are you ready for this? I'm ready. Guy on girl, I mean, girl on guy action. No. No! <laughs> Feel my darkness! <laughs> he's finna put, I mean, he's finna rock her boat. Why so glum? Don't rock the boat, baby. <laughs> Flowing in her ocean. That's been troubling you? How many times have I told you to turn on the fan? <laughs> <laughs> We're still making that joke. Of course. It's Why? been a year. That entire room is porcelain. <laughs> and she used oiled crayons, too. Oil based crayons? Not yeah. Where'd they get that? I don't know. She draws and stuff. stuff. Are they toxic? So? Shame on you, Disney. Shame on you. Giving kids worry. toxic crayons. And chicken. Whatever's hurting hey, wait, they have chicken? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, that'd away. be great if they did. Don't rock the boat, baby. Anyway, we got our good luck charm that Nominee gave us. The good luck charm. I thought it was made of paper. It is made of paper, but it's just got a chain connected to it. Another thing. Look like that before, dude. Another thing. If Riku, if Riku's like Nominee's best friend, or he thinks he is, why doesn't he save her from the organization? He's obviously getting bitched at by a bitch. That's Lark scene, if you guys forgot. Psst, well, what am I talking about? I just uploaded these videos a few days ago. You used the same trick on Sora, right? You changed Kyrie's. I don't think we see Sora at all in um Riku's playthrough, actually. Are you gonna miss Sora? Not really. I mean it, he was a cool character, he had a great character design a decent development when he had two games revolved around him. Yep. Actually, I really don't. I think Sora is the least developed uh, protagonist of Kingdom Hearts, if you think about it. I can't wait to do this on my desktop. You got Roxas, who's like a nobody, and he wants to know why he has a Keyblade. But he... I've lit bamboo on fire. No, wait. Uh -huh, that's why you can't light your bamboo on fire. You got Terra, Aqua, and Ventus, who are just like Keyblade masters from the get-go in Birth by Sleep. I won't reveal any of their story. That should be your incentive not to screw Then you just got Riku, who fears the darkness. Just do a good job rewriting Sora's heart. Mm -hmm. And he's still burning, burning shit on my. Of course I am. There's a lot of trees. There's gonna be like so many memes to go along with this. Burn to your disbelief. <laughs> and like, I love it how you can just see the KH thing, the KHvideo.net, just all over this place. Aren't you loving this? This is just like a little mini movie instead of like all the little gameplay clips. It makes it more interesting. Struck him down. Something I find deplorable. Oh my god. Agents it's if Cloud dyed his hair and grew it out. <laughs> it does look like that. Problem the funny thing is about Zexion is that he's the youngest member. Like Cloud? Yeah, he's still nah, Cloud youngest. was like at least 21 in Final Fantasy oh, 7. He he was the youngest. And I think he was like 23 by the time uh, Advent Children was. Yeah, yeah, I got meat. For our meat? Meat? He is I got killed a cat. The hero. <laughs> oh no, wait, that's a pig. No. Cows give you leather. When light I think both does down. that. Nope, just cats. We may find use for the dark. Oh, shit, man! <laughs> we haven't taken a drink in a while. <laughs> maybe, if we, maybe if we, like, stop talking for a second, we'd, like, probably hear them say darkness, like, 20 times more. But I like just, like, pointing it out as it comes along. 
Anyway, back to Riku. Man, I gotta search for this darkness. Dark. Like darkness is really into my darkness. <laughs> I probably shouldn't have dark that darkness. <laughs> darkness. Darkness. You might want to get a little closer. I don't think I can catch your voice or whatever. They can catch me just fine if I talk like this the whole time. Ah! Darkness. <laughs> anyway, there's a door. That was the most pointless cutscene. <laughs> this door leads to darkness. Awesome. Oh no, it's Lexius. Larxius. No, you know who that is? Who's that? That's it. Armstrong. Yes. Oh, no, we may. Well, lives. yeah, that's Armstrong right there. You've done well. Thus far. He got a giant ass. That's called a tomahawk, but it looks more like a big oh, ass sword. Axe. Yeah. Darkness. It doesn't really look like an axe, does it? It, it kind of like does, but the axe just only has the blade on the tip. That one's made of the blade. So. Yeah. It kind of is a sword. It's a, it's they, they say it's a scimitar. They call it a cross between a sword and an axe. It's a scimitar. Yeah. Scimitars are swords. swords with, yeah, swords with curved blades. And if I say Isn't no, that what Inuyasha have? Um, both light and darkness. Tetsaiga. Tetsaiga wasn't all the way curved, though. It was just bent. Damn, man. Like katana. You really curved. ripped one. Ugh. I gotta pinch out this air biscuit. <laughs> Coward. Coward. Come on, darkness. Stop resisting. Uh, the darkness. The darkness. Ah! Yep, take a drink. Hold it. <laughs> Need some more peps? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Pass me the peps. <laughs> anyway, we're fighting Lexius, the, the strongest physically of Organization 17. 13? 13. Shut up. <laughs> anyway. Streets and soda! <laughs> Lexius is the silent member of the whole gang, and he's just pretty much here just to be strong. But he doesn't really get that much character development. But, yeah, he's just a big guy. Nobody really cares about him. He's just stupidly powerful. He's always angry. <sighs> he has the deep voice. You know, why can't they just, like, make a really big guy who's, like, really smart and really awesome? They never do that anymore. They do. Who? In, uh... It's an anime, though. Oh, yeah. I mean, what is it called? Uh, Kenichi, the Great Disciple. Or the Greatest Disciple. History's Greatest Disciple, something like that. Is he fat? He, um, uh, no. He's not. They have, uh, his, like, greatest rival or whatever. When he goes into, like, the Super Saiyan mode, he's, like, the biggest shit, but he's still a genius. Ooh. Also, like most strong characters, his element is Earth. Earth! Mm. Water! Fire! Heart! Matter of fact, why the black guys gotta get well? The black guy had to get the shitty power of Earth. Actually, that was more useful. Than, talking, yeah, that was more useful than heart. Heart. Maybe not water, but definitely. Him. Anyway, we're summoning uh, Mickey to help us, and we're still getting our ass kicked. You know what I was wondering? Yeah. I wonder if Wheeler ever asked the one uh, wind chick from Kevin Plant. Yeah. Hey, baby. Can I get a blowjob? <laughs> oh. That's terrible. <laughs> Well, she can get it. Yay! Die, die! Sure you get. And so we kill him by throwing our sword through him. <sighs> so we're. Look, it looks more like a sonic boom to me. Sonic boom. <laughs> we're just killing off uh, 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 members like left and right. Vixen's already dead if you haven't You're realized finished. it. Wee! Watch this. Don't mock me. Bitch! Damn. Ugh! See, he doesn't need an invisible shield. He got his own sword. <laughs> he just said. Fuck See, me. for a second there, Riku was happy. He was like, "Yeah, no invisible shield." <laughs> Shut up! Oh, <laughs> uh, uh, what's that smell? Uh, what is that? It Man, you sold it. yourself. <laughs> what's that? It is. Uh. It's that one word we don't say too often. Yep. Uh, damn. <laughs> Uh, By the way, leave Splitter Jutsu. Too slow. You're too voice slow. His <laughs> voice the superiors. Yeah, that was Ansem's voice. He. You have to sleep alone tonight. <laughs> you have to find a new top now. I love Riku got like darker. Anyway, yeah, the the Ansem possessed his body so he can kill him. And look where Riku was trapped in. 
The darkness. Oh, God. Seriously, like, I know, like, Kingdom Hearts try to be, like, reciprocal with their, like, shit and try to be poetic, but the darkness is, like, awesome. I mean, it could mean something awesome. It doesn't have to always be something evil. Matter of fact, another example of, like, light isn't good. Damn, never mind. I got nothing. I don't know. Do you... Light isn't good. Well, you can go ahead and be blind. I don't know. Have you ever thought of, like, any series where light is just terrible? Yeah. What? Uh, no. Yeah, I only could think of from I, Vampire. I was going to say Digimon, that one, I think it was, what, the fourth nah. season? But it was his brother that was dark. And yeah. And he transferred over to the... He became that was, good. That's an example of... Dark, dark becoming good. good. Yeah. And that, that, and you know what, that's the theme at the end of the game. They're all like, dark doesn't mean it has to be evil. Yeah. So, I, I don't know of any example where light is bad, but I know an example where dark is cold. Anyway. Yeah, burning ducks. <laughs> Please tell me somebody saw that. Besides burning ducks, Riku is getting closer to the darkness, and the more he gets closer to the darkness, Ansem can, pos can possess him I'm and touch him. snakes to invade your body. Come here, let me touch you. I use this hand to wipe my ass. Bad touch, bad touch. Navi! He saved us. Your majesty. Stupid fairy. <laughs> Ugh, what are you gonna do? You're a mouse. I would just boot him. <laughs> Stupid king. That let's sounds. See, let's see how infectious this is. <laughs> Smoking on that fire. Man, he looks wasted. I think this is from too much <gasps> darkness. Ugh. He's like, where's the. D <sighs> the that. What? <laughs> The flag. That's what the king does. Matter of fact, there's a weapon called Save the King. It's a sword in Final Fantasy. That's probably why they made Mickey the King. Probably they incorporated Final Fantasy in this. Probably. And he has. There's a shield called Save or Protect the Queen or something like that. Protect the Queen, save the king. What does that make you? A god. <laughs> And so, Zexion lost Vexen and, uh, Larxius. Everybody's dead. Where's your girlfriend, Porsche? Huh? <laughs> yep, no Larxian. Well, you just heard Axel. Everybody's pretty much dead. Marluxia's pretty much next. No, I think it'll be Marluxia next. Yep. For anyway. Sora. They're pretty. Fire. They're trying to take over the organization, and Axel is really a mole, and he's killing them off. And Zexion, he's like the strategist, and he so, wants to know why Axel is trying to kill him off. I'm just making this up, though, because, we well, you guys will see. The Basically, they have really no reason of killing off the uh, three main members besides them just sucking, because. The three lower members of Organization 13 were sent to this castle because they suck. So, this is why these guys are here. And not in Kingdom Hearts 2. I need to play that game again. I actually have that in my room. You still got your PS2? Did you ever even have a PS2? I never had a PS2. Never mind. I have a Wii, I have a PS3, it was and I have a kick-ass computer. Fuck your kick-ass. Oh my god, what's that rumbling? It must be the darkness. Nope, that was Marluxia dying. Remember when we killed that guy with the plants? And that, that scythe. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was his explosion. Anyway, it's Axiom. Ooh, and I was right. Who's the Keyblade Master? Who do you think? Sora is here? Shut up. <laughs> no. It's obviously Sora, but we're not going to see him. He's just yanking our chain, pulling our leg, swilling our swindling. You think we're doing our balls? Yep. Still nest within your <laughs> what does that mean? Yeah. You plan to face Sora like that? A, Are you not a, a dragon? Dungeon dragon? Ruh, ruh. Okay, I'm sorry. Monster Rancher. <laughs> Monsters rule. Anyway, uh, since Ve or what's this guy's name? Zexion is like a super huge mastermind. He's just gonna keep. Uh, oh, he's a genius. Isn't yeah, he? he's just gonna be like toying with him and knowing how to get to him psychologically. Before he cracks, like most good villains should yes. do. Instead of actually trying to lure people to darkness with threats and stuff, you should just, like, fuck with their head. And have them come naturally, because they're that stupid. 
Oh, oh my gosh! Oh, oh. What happened to my island? Oh, ah, ah. It was oh. ah, ah. it was <laughs> it was nice before I went to the store. Even Titus and Wakas. See, look at him. The funny thing is, in the first game, they wanted to get off the island so bad that Riku went to the darkness. Just so he can get rid of I mean, just so he can get off the island. You remember that island scene, right? When we, at the beginning of the game. We got our ass kicked by Riku. Man, we suck. But anyway, it's time to not fight a damn dark side because I'm too lazy to go find the footage. Where did where did he go? Seriously. Hey, what's going on? How do we find an emo on an island? Sora. Hey, look, it's Sora. I guess we do see him. Sora. He can't hear us. Why? I have no idea. Sora. What's up? The density of the darkness. <gasps> he has a keyblade. Oh! Why don't I get an invisible shield? <laughs> Sora, don't you recognize me? No. Yeah, I recognize you. <laughs> no. Exactly what you've become. You use steroids now. Oh, my heart! That's cool. That he, I wish you could do that with Sora in the game. Just shoot light beams out and shit. Pew pew pew. Riku. Really become a creature of the dark? Damn! <laughs> Man, I'm getting roasty. There you go. <laughs> there it is. So be it. Anyway, it's time for you to face the Being a keyblade wielder, he must be I mean a keyblader of light, he must kill Riku. Cause there only can be one. The light! I'm a vampire! I'm <laughs> blind! I'm melting! <laughs> Wee. <laughs> he's in heaven. <laughs> Where is he, anyway? He's probably in hell. It's this probably is... what it looks like before you realize you're in hell. Really? Yeah, I'm like, all oh, right, I did go to heaven. Yeah, but wait, what about that time I killed and then all of a sudden the... <laughs> <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> hey, look, it's Kyrie. You just hear the devil's voice. Oh, I love doing that. Is Kyrie the devil? Maybe she's lost. She has the dark hair. I don't know. Red hair. So you're saying because I'm blonde, I'm going to go to heaven? That is bad. Never mind. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Those with nappy hair goes to a better place. It's called uh, the Universal Studios. I like Universal. They got their sweet ass. Well, I just think it's funny because that's where the, the Disney one is. And it's a Disney game. I know. <laughs> Universal Studios is better than. Well, Adventure Island is much better than fucking Disneyland. Fuck you, Florida. Fuck you, Orlando. Anyway, Kyrie's all like, oh, blah, blah, blah. I want to save you from the dark. Blah, blah, blah. Riku, get your ass up and protect yourself because that's really not Sora. <sighs> Pretty much, whenever the hero is going through some BDSism, uh, the heroine comes and tells him to feel better. And I really think you should look up some of the meaning of these words before you start using them. What did I use? BDSM. I'm, oh, shut up. I did not. <laughs> Anyway, it's really Naminé talking to him, but through Kyrie's image. Because Kyrie's dead, and we all know that. that. You know, they treat it like that, too. Like, she's dead, and they're fighting oh, for her. Oh, by the way, remember that chick you once knew? She's gone. We don't know what happened to her. We're assuming... Yep. The search party came back negative. Darkness! Yeah! <laughs> Time to take a drink. Maybe what if that was just battle mode? <gasps> all you had to do to activate it was just say darkness. I didn't know you can cut your way out of hell. Oh, my heart. But really, Zexion is an illusion master, and that's his power. The power of illusions. But he sucks in three so by like Zoralark. Who's that? <laughs> Zoralark? Oh. Zoralark, he's a legendary that you have to go... You have to get all three shiny legendary dogs, and then only... Shiny? Them. Yeah. They're making getting legendaries like fucking... Um, uh, never mind. Yeah, I know. But you, you can only get them when you have a shiny legendary dog in your party. You have to have all three or something like that. And you have to go to GameStop to get them. 
That is and it's, it's ridiculous. Anyway, we have to fight uh, Zexius. And you want to know what his weapon is? It's a book! <laughs> so, I summon... Moby Dick. <laughs> no, I'm dead fucking serious. In uh, 3 by 5 8 days, he hits people with a fucking book. Now, if he was like Read or Die and he was a paper master, well, That'd be cool. yeah, but I mean, that movie was awesome. I know, but I mean, like, he does use like some of his pages like a paper master, but he should like make a blade and be making like animals and shit. Uh, but he doesn't do that. No, he has to hit us with the damn Bible in darkness tornadoes. You know, I bet you, like, if we had this in English, they'd be like screaming darkness every five seconds. So how do you feel about having the power of illusions? Being able to change anything just by looking at somebody? Yeah, but it's just an illusion, though. It's yeah. not real. I know. You can't. I mean, you can make somebody think that their car is not stolen. And they say that if you can simulate enough pain to somebody, they can actually die off of it. Yes. So maybe it's not that bad of a power. Is he gonna make it? Is he gonna make it? Successful! <laughs> World straight flush! Is that what it's called? No. Oh, that would have been a badass name for it. Matter of fact, speaking of Royal Flush, let's do it! <laughs> time to do it. This is like around the time where the actual card game comes in because this game was supposed to be a card game, but they're all like, this is Kingdom Hearts, we gotta make it fun. <laughs> we gotta make it not suck. Yeah. <laughs> so let's just implement the card battles into the fighting style, and here we go. It's not a really bad system, though. I mean, it looks pretty fun, doesn't it? This is what would happen if Yu-Gi-Oh! inflicted actual physical damage to users. Yeah. They use this card to battle. I got a stick. Yeah. <laughs> I got a card that says I can use a stick. Oh, damn it. I need that card. Anyway, we broke his Bible. And now he's going to hell for real. <laughs> Atheism! <laughs> <laughs> That's what darkness truly is. <laughs> Have you know fun in limbo, dick. And so we kill another organization member. After all your protests, you're still like us on the side of darkness. Yep, take a drink. I know who I am. Oh, shit, I'm empty. When did that happen? <sighs> you were always terrified. I really don't like his voice. I wish I knew his voice actor, but I don't really feel like opening it. I think he's a good voice actor. He's got a wrong or a bad role or something. I would tell you to look it up, but you're actually recording. I'm doing shit. Yeah. So, on my behalf, uh, can your phone, well, actually, let me smile over here and grab this, yoink, I'll be taking this, yoink, <laughs> and like most, Yay! and like most pansy, uh, nerdy scientist people, Zexion goes away and he weeps in his defeat instead of dying like a man. And masturbates with the team. <laughs> uh, and who's here to save him? Hey, it's Riku and Axel, hey, Riku and Axel. Wait a minute, I'm Riku. Wait a second, what are you doing here? Can you guess what's about to happen, Snowman? Damn right. Who kills him, though? Oh, uh, Axel? No, it's Riku. Damn it. I wanted to have him do a Roy Mustang on his ass. Anyway, sadly, Zexion, is, since he failed against Riku, that's not why he's killing him. He's Whoa. actually killing him because he knows too much, allegedly. And that is explained in uh, 3 by 5, 8 days. But I'll explain it right now since it's pretty vague. But pretty much, uh, the red-haired guy and some other guy back in Organization 13, they want to take it over and they need to get rid of all the uh, upper-class members. And since he's in the way, he needs to die. And since he's probably the smartest, he will probably figure out their plan, and that's why they need to kill him. You foiled my plan. And now you must die. See, they're sucking the darkness out of him. Look. <laughs> Jedi choke. <laughs> Sounds like a real move, actually. It probably is, actually. So, yeah, he died. I'm on fire. <laughs> Fuck. Smoking on that fire. I set fire to myself. Zexian. Who's that? Oh, it's Ansem. Who the, whenever you hear a voice inside your fucking head, why won't you think it's Ansem? You, he's been talking to you the whole fucking game. See, I have voices in my head. None of them are Ansem. <laughs> I think you should get that checked out. Oh, his voice actor is Vincent Carroza. Or Carraza. 
I'm not like that now. Shut up. Yes, you are. <laughs> what does he do? No. I don't know. Let me check him out. Check his uh, biography. Oh, he was in Sailor Moon. He was Tuxedo Mask. Heck yeah. Holy shit. Tuxedo Mask is the only reason any guy ever watched that show. Even for real shit. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. And he was Va Ace Ventura. No, he wasn't. Yeah, probably in the cartoon show. Yeah, that's what I meant. Oh, well. He's not interesting. <laughs> Mickey's always gonna come to Riku's aid when you try to possess him, homie. <laughs> homie G. Slice. He just sent... What did he do to him? Hey! Oh. It's it's really <laughs> Mickey in the flesh. <laughs> he threw a water balloon full of light at him. <laughs> <laughs> a grenade of light. Oh ho ho ho. Is it you? Uh-huh. And then Your he Majesty. Your Majesty. Whoa. You don't have to call me that. You grew up on an island. You don't know who I am. Yeah, bitch. Matter of fact, get down on your knees and let me this crown you. <laughs> what if Mickey really wasn't the majesty? <laughs> really? Everybody just thought that. Why don't they make uh Yen Sid the majesty or whatever? <laughs> Uh, he was Mickey's teacher and Sorcerer's Apprentice. You ever seen Fantasia? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that guy. And he's in this game. Well, he's in the second game. And Birth by Sleep. No spoilers intended. Sorry about that. Oh. Ouch! Oh, no. It's getting dark. I must light more fire. Anyway, I don't know how Riku or uh, Mickey actually got in this castle. It's just like said that they somehow got here because the darkness led them there, even though they were inside Kingdom Hearts after the first game. It's really not explained. Just go with it. Square Enix is not that good at telling stories. Well, they are, but they, they leave so many things vague. But it's not It's not like it needs to be explained. It's like Heroes. You ever watch that show? Nope. Lost? Nope. Uh... God damn. Uh, fast forward? Nope. NYPD? Nope. Family Guy? Nope. You did watch Family Guy. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we're in Twilight. No, we're in. What is this place called? Oh, Twilight Town. Nice. I was right. I was right. I was right. I was right. Right, right, right. Left, left, left. Right, left, right. Okay. And so. Your Majesty. Ah, oh, crap. It's handsome. Can you guess who's the final boss of this last, of this playthrough is? Snowman. Isn't that obvious? It's Goofy. Yes. That'd be a sweet-ass battle. Fighting Goofy? What's this? Yeah. Wow. Are you giving up? Dave Boat voices, uh, freaking, <laughs> free, freaking voices Lexius, and I don't think he's never done anything. I think he's just a producer of the game, and he just said, let me voice this guy. He only gets a few lines. That's what, uh, Seth MacFarlane did in Family Guy. Really? I yeah, thought he wanted to Brian, voice... Brian is his natural voice. Yeah, I know, but I'm just saying, like, I thought he, Peter, but... Peter and Stewie were just, like, given his role, though. Yeah, no, they were. But his, the idea of Brian was just because he wanted to hear his own voice. It was funny, because they showed him on Inside the Actors Studio. I love that show. And he was like, so where did the idea of Brian come from? And he was just like, honestly, I just like the sound of my own voice. You asshole. <laughs> what a pompous asshole. But no, like... It's like Brian literally is him. Like when darkness. Brian drank martinis, Seth MacFarlane drank martinis, and when Seth MacFarlane switched to like hard liquor, mm -hmm. that's when Brian switched to hard liquor. Wow. Yeah. So it, oh, Brian's crap. like a reflection of himself. So, so Look, it's Spoiler Man. I can't reveal who this is, but everybody knows his name is Dix. Really? Dix. Dix. Diz. <laughs> it's Diz. Diz. Somebody has Dix on their mind. Shut up. Yep, his the guy who voiced uh voice Anselm was Paul St. Peter's. And he was just in a whole bunch of uh, fucking anime. Nothing noteworthy of though. You will know soon. You will know soon. Wait, here's one. He was Wormon in Digimon. The guy the voice of Anselm. Please, <laughs> tell me. Stop feeding into the darkness. Okay. That was another theme. Ken was going into the darkness in fucking Digimon Zero Two. Yeah. Anyway, Digimon Emperor. It's time to have our final showdown with our copy of Self. Oh. How many times did we fight this guy in this game? Oh, <laughs> about <laughs> about. Did you ever see uh, Adventure Time? Yeah. Have you seen the episode with the unicorn? 
How can you tell? No. Oh, how did you not see that? Because I don't really watch. I like watching when I'm at school, no, but when I'm at I'm home, me. I don't really do it. I don't really watch. I need it's Cedric. like the second episode. I seen the pilot. Did you see the pilot? Nope. Okay then. Hey, shut up. Anyway, Riku's all like, I want to kill you because you're my clone and I hate you and I... I a jack o -lantern. Yeah, that too. How did you make a jack o lantern on Minecraft? Because I'm badass. That's why. That's actually not that bad. You're just being a dick. I hate being a coward. All the girls at school laugh at me. The boys pull out my gym shorts. Take a drink. Oh, did you say darkness? Yeah. Nothing changes. I'm still just empty. He's like a nobody. Everything about inside. me is borrowed. As long as you're around, Turn me up. I'll oh, shit, I burned myself. Man, whoever voiced Riku is really good, though. He makes his clone self sound even more edgier than, than his real self. Anyway, here's our final battle with Super Saiyan 2 Riku. And he has a palm full of darkness. Ah! Isn't he a jerk? Pretty much. Hard door. <laughs> we put him there just like pulling him out like ha <laughs> ha Yeah, the deck and he's just like I know! <laughs> that would actually be pretty cool though! And like as he's pulling him out, he's like slashing him or something. Is he like the guy who's actually playing this just mashing the button like Say 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 Haruga! Mickey combo! Oh! And now we get a skirt to battle with. Oh, did he summon the darkness? Pretty much. Do you really think darkness is like a cooler power than light? I think so. I think not. Uh, yeah. yeah. I like light because there's a lot you can do with it. If you can manipulate light, you can bend it. And, you, know, you can make people like, blind. Exactly, but with darkness you can do the same thing. Yeah, but you could make it. You can do cooler things with darkness. You can hide in the shadows. You can uh, what you call it? Make it so cold that people freeze. There's no light. There's no heat. No light. Anyway, we killed Riku with the help of Mickey, as always. Thanks, Mickey. No problem, yo. <laughs> <laughs> no problem, kid. Ah, uh, yeah, what is he falling into? Look. He's lying in a puddle of what? Death doesn't frighten me. Water? <sighs> Dark water. Radiance to a pony life. <laughs> <laughs> it has been My heart a red was dawn. Never real. My heart was never real because I am just a clone. I feel it now. It's probably all fake. I can feel it. I can feel it in the air. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say that too. <laughs> I can feel it coming in the air tonight. Oh Lord. Anyway, Riku is fading away because he was just a clone and he was never the real thing. Maybe to the same place as mine. I've been waiting for this moment. Fuck you. Shut <laughs> Why, whenever somebody's dying, like a villain, they're just all like, goodbye. I, I can't do anything except talk my heart out. And, dead. and so, Repliku is dead. Repliku? That's, that's what the fandom calls him. Anyway, we're almost at the end. Yay. Hooray. Yay. Hey, you. Come out. Don't be shy. I made Boom Boom. <laughs> Are you nominate? Hey, Hotness! What's up? Hey, Hotness, what's up? Little <laughs> bitch. Forget it. Anyway, can you guess what's in that shell, Snowman? Please. Behind her, there's a big egg. What's inside of that egg? Tyre? No. Damn. Look! Sora? Yep. Oh. Let him out! <laughs> no, he Let needs... Let him out now! <laughs> he needs to stay in there. <laughs> or his memories won't come back. Let him out now! <laughs> I don't want him to remember me as being a dick. <laughs> that would be awesome! That would be funny if he like, actually asked her to do that. And matter of fact, matter of fact, in Kingdom Hearts 2, Sora doesn't acknowledge Riku as like, losing himself to the darkness or kicking his ass. So they did open it earlier. I think they did! And they're all like, you know what, let me, let me, just, let me just change this around. Oh yeah, and that PS3 that he owns, uh, I let him borrow that. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be awesome. Tell him his firstborn child is mine. 
Why? <laughs> They're sitting there talking, and all of a sudden you hear, Bing! <laughs> oh, he's done. Let's get out. <laughs> Egg timer. I, can put a tight I have Any- a Riku timer. <laughs> gay. Anyway, Namine's explaining her powers of replicating or duplicating and... What to play with people's memories. Yeah, she can manipulate people's memories. We already know this. We Remember already know this. Remember that time you went to Disney World? Yeah. You were there. <laughs> really? Yeah. I replaced it because you had a very depressing memory of when your uncle touched you. Oh, God. <laughs> that went really dark really quick. <laughs> By the way, it was Ansem that touched you. Oh, puns. Please, James. I'm voiced by a 23-year-old. He, she is, actually. Who is nominated voice by? I never did a voice actor check on her. You know what? Well, what? Like that too. She's 23. Is she? No. You don't know that. You know, I'd laugh if she was, not Sora always did as he pleased. <laughs> that got sound so dirty. <laughs> you remember when we used to spoon. <laughs> he used to lay next to me. He drank his leg over Matter of fact, can I get in there with him? Just like, just, just squeeze Why in there. Why would you want to? <laughs> no, I'm just saying, that's what Riku would just be all like. Ah, uh, our Kingdom Hearts playthrough wouldn't be complete without gay jokes. Of course not. It's, it's part It's of, not that the game's gay at all, no. Like, the game's a great game. Yeah. It's just so easy to poke fun at. And they call their friendship, like, as it's like, uh, what is it called? Your relationship. Yeah. Uh, excuse me, just for the record, we never held hands. Really? So, I'd appreciate it if you just said friendship. The friendship. The friendship but of the our ring. relationship, please, can you just stop saying that? That's weird, though. They really don't acknowledge that they have, like, a relationship. Not, not with Kyrie, not with Namine. I think when we edit all of our Let's Plays, yeah. we should add in some of Why? Because I think it'd be funny. It would be like funny. when they crack That's open the egg and let Re- or Sora line. out. It should be like the <laughs> the Mac sound. <laughs> when the Mac computer boots up. What? Or when uh when Sora <laughs> when Sora <laughs> Sora checks his pocket and finds that little charm. It could be like you've got mail. <laughs> Technically, I do got this recorded on Audacity, so it would be really easy to just, like, edit sounds in. I guess you decided not to go to sleep. Anyway, Riku has his memories. Nobody's been fucking with his. But we have to go and confront the final man himself. No, not Diz. He's a good guy. Even though he doesn't look like he's it. He's a good guy? Yeah. <laughs> That's what, No, in the second game, like, he's, well, like, a bad guy sure. for, like, five minutes, and then he becomes a good guy. He doesn't look like a good guy, though. By the way, you know how I said Namora had a belt fetish? That really shows. I'm made of belts. <laughs> he has a belt on his face. He has two belts. Belt face. He has a buckle over his eye. Wow. <laughs> What's your superpower? Belt vision? <laughs> <laughs> Boy, you really like pushing the Actually, Nominee has two voice actors. It's Brittany Snow and Megan Jet Martin. <laughs> I'll look at Brittany Snow. She sounds more interesting. Because her last name is Snow. Anyway, Diz is all like, you have a choice to either follow the darkness or follow the light. I'm really good at explaining these, even though like I don't really know how the cutscenes go. I don't know what's going on. I'm I know. Shit. Anyway, we get a uh, organization jacket, which allows us to control our dark powers. Are you serious? Yeah, look. Badass. We should buy some. Oh God! Look, next look, look at Britney Snow. Out. Told you. She, she, she's 24, but at the time of the making this game, she was 22. Wow, Snowman. See how good am I? Your dude should range. No, yeah, but seriously, we can get organization coats, and when Yomacon rolls around next year, we'll be ready. Yes. I actually like going to Yomacon. That's the only like anime. This is the only place I don't feel weird. She was in Hairspray, and she was in American Dreams. Yeah, that doesn't really sound that interesting. I was gonna say, Hairspray's a chick. Sorry, darling. The darkness. Take a drink. Damn it, I'm empty. <laughs> yep, take a drink. Here's a card. Why does everybody keep throwing it? <laughs> they really just need to play back it like he doesn't catch at least one of them. I want to see, like, an end cutscene of a game where, like, it's him and Sora sitting down trading cards. Yep, and here's Megan Jet. 
Mega Jet looks more like she's probably 18. Yeah, she's actually... Yeah, she's 18! <laughs> Holy shit, you're good at this. I am. I've studied the women. She was in Camp Rock. Camp Rock 2. Oh, and she's in 10 Things I Hate About You. That's why. She's Disney. Yeah. <laughs> so, oh, yeah. 10 Things I Hate About You? Yeah. That's who that is. Yeah, so she plays Nomine. Holy crap. She's hot. Yeah? Except in 10 Things I Hate About You, she looked like she was like... Well, and she was supposed to play like a 16 year old. Yeah. Wait, what? Yeah. I mean, at the time, I'm pretty sure she was. She was 12. Any, anyway, back to Kingdom Hearts. Um, Riku's gearing up to fight Ansem. I'm gonna put on my coat. Is there a changing room? It's just a coat. <laughs> anyway, Mickey wants to help him because pretty much he won't be able to do it without him. Because I can't fight. Because I'm the king. You don't believe I'll come through for you. This really doesn't sound like Mickey, by the way. Well, I mean, the original voice actor died. The, yeah, both of them actually are dead. Like, there was one that played him back in, like, the 40s and 50s, and then there was one that played him, like, from the 80s then on. And he's dead. He died in 2009. There was a, a time frame when uh, all voice actors were just, like... Dead. Or no, not the voice actors. The actual characters didn't have voices. They would just play music. Yeah, that was back in the silent era. Anyway, we gotta gear up, fight Ansem, and he's not coming out. I'm gonna make this a floating island. <sighs> you and your I'll damn be. Minecraft. Hey, shut up. Yeah, Snowman's still playing Minecraft. Everybody just, just throw stuff at him, like, like if you see him. We hate you, I'll burn you! <laughs> Hey, but you're a snowman. Can't we just melt you? Oh, 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 oh. Guess what? <laughs> I'm gonna shove an ice skull up your ass. Ew. Yeah, you wouldn't what like that. Hurt? I smell you, Anson. Ew. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> smell like darkness. <laughs> Come on, I need something I to drink. I watched you fight. I know your strength. <laughs> and all your, your weaknesses. Your skill with darkness <laughs> has grown. Uh, it is. Yeah, well, wait, take a drink. Sure. <laughs> Not now. I'm and making an island. <laughs> Make your fucking island. The floating you mountains darkness, of the Himalayas. But still refuse me. Take a drink. Nope. You know you and I are similar. Anyway, we both, the both. There's an allusion to Ansem's relationship with Riku right here. Xanort's relationship with Terra reflects that. Now, you guys need to go play Birth by Sleep, cough up a hundred bucks just to buy a PSP real quick, play it in a week, take it right back, get your money back, boom. But anyway, we need to kill Ansem so we can get rid of the darkness. We can get rid of the darkness forever. And he's just a figment of our imagination when you really think about it. Yes, you are. Shut off. Or did you forget? I am awesome. I used all the power you had to give, and Sora still beat me. I'm not at all impressed with your powers. That's that's pretty pathetic. <laughs> you gave me all your powers, and he still beat me. So that means you must suck. Oh wow! See, he finally used a different word to reflect on darkness. He calls it the abyss. Oh God. Abyss. There's no teeth. Actually, that's what I say when we're playing Waterfall, and we just chug, and I say, send us to the abyss. Ha 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 ha! Like how I did that? No. Again, there's no tea. Anyway. I would know. Oh, God. Anyway, Crap. that's his guardian. Crap. Crap. And here's our final boss with Ansem. And his magnificent tan, even though I like to call him a white-haired <laughs> dark skin. Darky. Darky. Brett yep. There it is. His name is Brett Iwin. That's Brett Iwin. I think that's his name. And he's Gene yeah. Starwin. <laughs> he plays Mickey now. Now that the other guy died. Shota. Shota. Suki dage. I don't know. Ah. Uh -huh. Japanese is a hard language. Oh, Unless you like grow up learning it. Then you're gonna get like a Japanese fan who's all like, "Oh, I learned that in about a year." Oh, 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 you waste a year of your life. I know, fucking asshole. Oh, what? Who's that a star? I wonder if that Japanese are very uh. Well, I shouldn't say this number. Racist? No, not racist. More like xenophobic. They don't really like foreigners. My mother was telling me about how she went to Japan before. Really? 
Yep, and she said that some people would move from the side of the street that she's on just because she's there. But there were some nicer Japanese people that would just like approach her in a restaurant and just take pictures with her. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Look, Negro. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take pictures. <laughs> anyway, we're kicking Ansem's ass. Have you ever read JoJo's A Bizarre v Adventure? I watched Snowman. The I, didn't, I didn't read the actual manga. Anyway, look, Ansem has a stand. Oh. Look, you can see it in the background. Holy crap, he does. <laughs> I would not believe your eyes. <laughs> if I had to tell you I had a stand, I don't know what you're saying. If you guys, Antfish. yeah, watch Antfish's uh, a bridge series of what? What's it called? JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Bridge. Yep, and this is the third part too, the good part where it's uh, about JoJo Joestar and his stand, not the first, the beginning parts because they'll suck. <sighs> but anyway, uh, we got five minutes to kill. Uh, you got anything to bring up? Um, not really. I mean. I'm going to try and make more videos, are you? I don't know. I'm really getting tired of making LPs. I mean, I just sat down one night and was all... <laughs> <laughs> I was just sitting... See, this is what drinking to darkness do. <laughs> uh, I was just sitting down one night and I was just wondering, why do I even do LPs anymore? It's not as fun as it used to be. Yeah. It's more of a chore. But I'll still come around when the time is right. I'll be like Mickey. Damn it, man! We were supposed to kill him. Oh, well. <sighs> and now we're both on the floor drunk. I'm not drunk. I'm just... <laughs> Shut up. Boy, oh, boy. Spitting blocks in the ocean. Fuck your fucking game. Of mo You're killing ducks. Anyway, we kill him with another Adugan. This is a good way to kill somebody, though. Just throw a fucking sword in their back. Throw a sword at somebody through. And so we defeat Ansem. Isn't he handsome? Because he's handsome. Hey. Handsome Tom. Handsome Rob. Salugan! Uh, see, he can finally block the darkness. Ho ha! Finally, a shield wasn't around Pete him. He's like, damn, I forgot. <laughs> My shield at home. This is small. Ah, <laughs> oh, take a drink. Damn. Lingers someday. Mm. Someday. That's an allusion to Kingdom Hearts 3DS, which isn't out by now, but it's supposed to come out uh, when a 3D DS comes out. So. What's the launch title for the 3DS? I have no idea. I know it's coming out in like. Spring in Japan. I don't know. Probably here it's going to come around the uh, Christmas season. Anyway, we're sucked in darkness, like always. And he here's Mickey, and he's all like, Hey, I'm going to save you. He's like God. Now that I think about it, Mickey is God in like Kingdom Hearts universe. Because he's the king of pop. So he really so didn't... Mufasa. He, Mufasa's a prophet. The funny thing is, Mufasa died before he even made an appearance in Kingdom Hearts. Did he? Yep. And so we walk together, looking badass, after Riku finally destroyed his darkness. He can still unleash it, but now he has it controlled. I can't go home. Isn't that awesome? Not yet. What? He has the power over darkness now. Here. It's really I'm a good dark. I can sense him. Yep. Ansem is still inside of him, but he can't take control of him because he has control over his own darkness. Take a drink. I ran out of drink. Fuck it. Matter of fact, here it is. We drank a whole two liter of We drank a whole two liter of Pepsi! Holy shit! We're drinking the darkness, that's what you do. I didn't know. Light and dark back to back. Yeah. Nobody. Yeah, Riku has the power over light and darkness. Like I said, it's an illusion because Riku has control over darkness, but well, he can go through the light. light. You can kind of control darkness too. Yeah. So, even though 
you can, you can still have light. You can't have light without darkness. So that's that's the revelation of this game. So yeah, we don't have to call King Mickey King anymore. So let's just keep calling him Mickey Snowman. Hey Mickey. We started. Hey Mickey. Anyway, we end the game back over on Gay Hill. Walking side by side in our kick ass organization coats. Even Mickey has one. I, I still say it's a cult. That's adorable. Anyway, uh, in this part, uh, Riku gets his blindfold, and now he gets to choose which path he gets to take. This is pretty symbolic here. And this is going to be our climax. So, anything left to say, Snowman? What are you making me choose now? Between the road Not really. to light. And I don't either. And the road to dark. Which way will he take, though? What world will you take then? I'm huh? taking the middle road. <laughs> I'll take the low Do road. You mean the twilight road. Oh God! What did he say? The twilight road. It's the road to dawn. <laughs> See you guys.